Europe and the world is in crisis and there is no doubt about it and uh, Poland unfortunately makes no difference with this situation and we are uh, in the uh, democratic uh, crisis and we join this family of uh, countries which are uh, uh, losing its democratic path and uh, uh, looking for new way of uh, authoritarian democracy, if I can call it, and it's a terrifying uh, effect, and it's an effect which uh, um, uh, has to do a lot with uh, the current situation around the world where global economies, uh, uh, um, refugee crisis, uh, um, lack of trust in politics is, uh, um, is gaining, and uh, there is, on another side, no answer from traditional, I would say, politics on that. Uh, this uh, strengthens populism and uh, the populistic movements, not only in Poland, but whole region and whole world, uh, are gaining uh, power and uh, there is urgent need for answers. And uh, uh, I wonder why we have so little answers for that. We have diagnosis, we have, uh, we know what's going on, but we don't have answers for that. And uh, concerning European Union, we had so many integrational concepts. We knew how to integrate Europe, but we never have created any theory which will talk about the situation when Europe is becoming disintegrated. So uh, I think what we should rethink is traditional politics. Uh, people don't trust politicians. Uh, there is a growing gap between uh, decision makers and uh, uh, Europeans. The recent opinion polls of European Commission shows that 87% of Europeans distrust uh, um, uh, politicians and uh, we should think how to engage those people in decision-making process. Traditional political parties, and I know it might be a big disappointment to some of us, uh, are losing its power. We need to be clever enough to uh, include uh, um, the new movements, the movements which are being created in internet, the black protests of women in Poland, anti-ACTA protests uh, around uh, um, Europe, into this decision-making process of traditional political parties. It's a challenge, it's a new thing, but this uh, new situation uh, expects us new way of thinking, something fresh, something uh, more democratic, something more participatory, something more even, I would say, in positive way, populist, which will bring the power to people, the power which we left in the hands of technocrats, of lobbyists, of uh, European Union institutions, of our country institutions. Now, the disappointment of the people shows us clearly there is new expectation for new power, new energy for Europe and the world. And uh, um, these answers will fight against the authoritarian democracies, not only in Poland, but all around the world. But we need to be brave. We need to be brave enough to uh, formulate a new concept, especially we as left, as social democrats, as people who were always progressive. What has happened to us that uh, um, after so many successes in Europe and around the world concerning equality, freedoms, uh, uh, welfare state, it's all us, it's uh, the, the left which uh, created these concepts, that today when people are waiting for new concepts, we are not uh, strong enough to do it. Let's get united, let's look for new concepts and let's do it together. Thank you.